Hello so guys, today I'm going to show you how you can go ahead and fix your connection problems on Streamlabs OBS. So for example, if you try to go live or do something else and you have like these connection problems or uh, fetching file failed or something like that. So it's quite easy to fix actually. So first off, what you want to make sure of is that your internet connection is quite good. So what you can do for example is just test your internet connection, go to a new tab and search up test internet connection and see how it performs so once you've done that and your internet connection is quite good and you made sure of that go for to settings and first off you want to go ahead and go to scene collections because you want to first off save our scenes before doing anything else we don't want to lose our scenes like you see over here so go over to export overlay file and now save up your scene as something whatever you want and click on save so I already have one saved over here I'm not gonna save it again so once you're done you can go ahead and go to import overlay file and also select it back and just re upload it to your Streamlabs OBS but don't do that right now guys because we are gonna go to general right now and we are going to delete cache and restart so it is cool to actually fix your problem guys and what happens is if you do this like it says on here warning you will lose all of your stream and color settings if you are logged in your scenes and source will be restored from your cloud so like it says over here you could lose some stuff but your settings will remain the same i mean your settings will get removed guys so remember that but your scenes i think it will just stay if you just log in with your account again but you just want to click on ok and let's just say that you lost some scenes and it isn't there anymore what you can do easily is go to settings go to scene collection and go to import overlay file and you can just select the uh, saved scene and just open it up so that's just a backup guys now this is the fix number one what you can do just by deleting the cache and restarting uh, it kind of sucks like but it's only gonna take you like a minute or two to get your settings back to normal it's really simple so once we are done with that let's go to the second fix what you al also can do so what you want to do is you want to open up twitch because this problem most likely happens to the twitch users and you want to go over to your icon over here and now go over to create your dashboard now go over to here click on channel and what will happen is guys it could actually happen you will get a warning sign over here it's not more a warning sign but in red letters it will say uh, activate two-factor authentication or something like that and you want to press on that guys while you press on that it will actually maybe fix off your problem so once you unpress on that what will happen is i already did it so it doesn't show up anymore but it won't ask you to fetch file or something like that or fetching file failed and so once you do that guys you have to like uh, add, like add your phone number or something like that and add a two-step verification actually so once you do that it will actually fix your problem and that's how easy it actually is so this is how you can fix your problem on streamlabs obs the connection problems and what i recommend you guys to do next is just restart your computer and see how it goes this could also be a fix guys just by restarting your computer but you first off want to do this what i just did go to the two factor settings and enabling that on here in red letters so thanks for watching guys i hope you enjoyed it and if you fix it you can also drop a like and also subscribe guys you can also drop a comment down below if you have more questions and take care guys you can also follow me at twitter and instagram i'll leave a link in the description down below take care